Okay, this week's magic class or spell class, we're going to talk about one of my favorite summertime types of magic, bubble magic. Nope, you don't need to go to your favorite metaphysical or occult store. Nope, nope, you get to go to your drug store, your toy store, or your dollar store to get bubbles. Bubbles, you say? Yes, mugwort. Don't need the mugwort. Don't need your athame. You don't need your thing. Bubbles. I have three forms of bubbles because you know what? Bubbles themselves are combining air magic, earth magic, water magic. You're not going to start a fire in fire season. You're not going to burn down your house. You're going to put the most powerful thing you have into your bubbles, your breath. I say it often, whenever you could speak out loud, speak out loud because the breath is your pneuma. It's your life force. The moisture in your breath is your free will. So all of a sudden you've got your little bubble out and you're blowing your wishes, blowing your spell work into the winds, into the east winds to take it on the magic. So I'll tell you why I have three. Actually, it came as a three pack. I have pink for love. I drew a little heart on the top. Love, you need love, any kind of love. Some of you need romantic love, love with their kids, love with their friends, just self love. Do some bubble magic. Green, money magic. You could do this almost every morning. Get your bubbles out and going, I am blowing my abundance into the wind. Green for money magic. I drew a dollar sign. Blue, it came with blue. And what's the other thing that everybody wants, either in their psychic readings or in their spell work? Health. It always goes, love money, health. So blue for health. It's a nice high vibration color. So I have the health. So if you have a little inexpensive three pack of bubbles, you have an entire spell working kit. Indeed you do. Like any spell working, set up your sacred space, set your intent. Remember intent is the number one ingredient in every spell working or manifestation or ritual. Number two is passion. Passion fuels a skill. Passion fuels a spell, doubt kills it. So get your bubbles, get your passion, get your intent. Start your day, end your day, run out. Teach your kids some bubble magic. You're gonna teach them to manifest. You're gonna teach them to create what they want in life. You're gonna teach them to speak their truths. And again, nobody's gonna burn down the house or get crayons all over. So pink for love, blue for health, green for money. Think of you what you're going to do or whatever color you want. Again, you create your magic. So you're going to get your spell out. You're going to get your spell right out. Here's a little thing that, you know, maybe you set up sacred space. Maybe you're just out there and then you're outside and you're going to think of what you want. You're going to think, okay, green money. Okay, I'm going to ask my boss for a raise today or I'm going to go play the lottery, whatever you want to do. See it, smell it, taste it. And when you are ready, I knew it was going to not work right. <laughs> Blow the I'm not very good at bubbles, which is good because it makes me passionate. It makes me passionate. It makes me work at it and focus until I get the bubbles right. So some people are naturally better than others. Some people need to add a little glycerin, which I'm planning to do. But send those blessings. Watch the bubbles go up into the sky, up into the clouds, down to the floor. Have your dog catch them. Cats love them too. So it's magic you can even do indoors. You could do outdoors. You've got your breath, you've got your pneuma, you've got your life force, you've got your free will, you've got magic. Magic is everywhere. You just gotta blow it into bubbles sometime. Mm -hmm.